Good day YouTube. This is just a bit of a quick video on the hardware resource usage comparison between Kubuntu 19.10 on the left and Kubuntu 20.04 latest release on the right. So it'll be a very, very quick video. So I'll load up everything here. Now it is loaded up from scratch, so there's nothing really else on this machine in the background except for the operating system itself. But uh, let's have a look. So starting off with the RAM, if we were to have a look here. So pretty interesting here, about 700, 720 mega of RAM straight off the bat for Kubuntu. 20.04. Not to be unexpected, it is quite similar to Ubuntu. It used to run at about a gigabyte or even two gigabytes some time ago, but they do seem to have optimized the uh, the KDE uh, desktop environment, of which uh, could take up a lot of the RAM there. On the left hand side, we have the older version, slightly older version of Kubuntu, uh, Kubuntu 19.10, which is only um, uh, has a, a support lifespan of an, an extra couple of months. So if you do have it, you definitely want to upgrade to this one soon. But just have a bit of a look. It is a little bit optimized better, perhaps, or just less coding in the background there. So 614 megabytes of RAM straight off the bat. So that is, uh, yeah, not as much, probably about 10, 15, 20% less, perhaps, that kind of thing. So yeah, really good to see that it's not running on as much RAM there. But uh, in terms of the CPU, it's all mostly idling out. As soon as I say that, it, it starts to trickle in with 18, 20% here and there. But uh, yeah, that's, uh, they are, it's surprisingly the KDE desktop environment of which Kubuntu is, is really uh, champions is, it's, it's just, yeah, it's designed to be a little bit more, have a bit more user functionality, more options, more widgets, uh, and therefore usually a little bit more resource heavy, but it doesn't so seem to be the case like it used to be. It's not a personal preference for me. To me, it's meant to look, well, it's meant to look lovely, but it, beautiful, but it, to me it looks a little bit ugly. And yeah, it's fully featured, but um, it's, it's sometimes not required depending on how you feel. I'd prefer to stick with the stock Ubuntu experience, but hey, that's just me. So that's pretty much it, guys. Just a super simple, quick, now long-winded uh, video on the uh, comparison of the resource usage between Ubuntu 19.10 on the left and Ubuntu 20.04 on the right. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, subscribe, and all of those nice things. Cheers.